Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. So, I am Margarine Alipolito. Ang tutuhin sa inyo upang malaman kung ano ang ibig sabihin ng fraction. Okay, so for today's video, malalaman natin kung ano ang ibig sabihin ng fraction at ang kinds of fractions. Okay, so again, before we start, I just want you to click the subscribe and bell icon to notify you for my next videos that I'm going to post. Okay, so let's start. Okay guys, start na tayo sa ating topic for today which is fractions. Okay, so fraction is a number that represents a whole number that has been divided into equal parts. Okay, let me take for example, meron kang isang buong pizza pie. So, haatiin mo siya sa walo. So, yung walong yun, ayun yung divided into equal parts. Okay, so another example. Meron kang isang buong pizza pie, hahatiin mo siya sa apat. Okay, so yung friend mo ay kumuha ng isang peraso or isang slice ng pizza pie mo. So, ito yung itsura niya. Okay, so yung shade niya, ayan yung numerator or yung number na nasa itaas ng fraction bar. Tapos, yung natira naman or yung hate na binigay mo, ayun naman yung denominator or yung number na nasa ito pa ng fraction bar. Okay, so kung babasahin mo siya, ang basa niya ay 1 fourth. 1 over 4. Okay, so dito naman tayo sa types or kinds of fractions. So, those are proper fraction, improper fraction, similar fraction, dissimilar fraction, equivalent fraction, mixed fraction, and equal to 1. So, ngayon, itatopic natin yan lahat. Start tayo sa fraction. The numerator is less than denominator. So, ang ibig sabihin nito, kung ang numerator ay 1, ang denominator naman ay 2 dahil mas onte yung numerator. So, example nito ay 1 half, 2 thirds, at 3 fourths. Okay, so kung merong proper fraction, meron namang improper fraction. The numerator is greater than denominator. Kung ang proper fraction, ang numerator ang mas onte sa denominator, ang improper fraction naman, ang numerator ay ang mas mataas sa denominator. So, ang example nito ay 2 over 1, 3 over 2, at 4 over 3. Okay, so, pangatlo, similar fraction is when the two fraction is being compared, their denominator is the same. So, ang example nito ay 3 6 and 5 6. So, yung similar fractions, kapag tinignan mo yung denominator nila, or yung nasa ibaba ng fraction bar, at kapag ito ay parehas or the same, ito ay tinatawag na similar fractions similar fraction when their denominators is not the same or different. Kabalikaran lang siya ng similar fraction. Ang example ng dissimilar fraction ay 3 fourth and 5 6. Next equivalent fraction. Ito medyo madali lang. Is when you cross multiply the two fractions their answer is the same. Example, 2 third is equal to 4 6. 2 times 6 equals 12 and 3 times 4 equals 12. So, kaya sila naging equivalent fraction. Number 6, mixed fraction is when you see the whole number at the side of fractions. Ang example nito ay 4 and 3 fifths. Ang 4, ang 4 na bilogo, ang 4 na whole. At ang 3 fifths naman, 5 hati at 3 yung um, nabawasan or kinulayan. Okay, last one equal to 1. Is when the numerator and denominator is the same. Ang example nito ay 7 over 7. Okay guys, tapos na nga po tayo.
guys sa ating video for today. So, I hope na nagustuhan nyo ang aking vlog. So, again, kung hindi nyo pa masyadong naintindihan kung ano ang ibig sabihin ng fraction at kinds of fraction, pwede nyo ulit-ulitin o balik-balikan ang video na to. So, again, I just want you to click the subscribe and bell icon to notify you for my next videos that I'm going to post. So, you can comment below para sa mga topics na gusto nyo itakal natin everyday. And then, see you on my next video. Bye-bye!